guys, Mermaid Treasure Hunter here. I just got to Oregon to help my mom celebrate her 82nd birthday. But first, let's get out there on the property and see what we can find with our Fisher F-19. Okay, you guys, I am in Oregon and I am doing a little treasure hunting with my F-19. Here's something right here. Okay, I just found a minute ago this um, ratchet connector. And so my dad has like 12 of every possible tool. <laughs> so I guess he wasn't too worried about it. And then I found this piece of iron. Woo, and it's all nasty. I don't know what that's from. Maybe my mom's tractor or something. Maybe part of the blade fell off. Anyway, let's see what this is. It says it's right at the surface. And it says it's kind of big. Look what I have, you guys. I have my F-Pulse. Finally, I am loving this thing. It is awesome. Okay, here it is. What do you think it is? Well, you guys, ooh, this is something big. Oh no, my mom lost her tractor blade. Um, she has a lawnmower that is a Husqvarna tractor. Oh no, this is a pole or something. What is this? Yeah. Something. Oh, it's a pin. Huh. Well, there you go. It's a marker pin. Huh. That's interesting, isn't it? Okay, well, let's spray that baby. And oh, my parents sold, or the neighbor, my aunt and uncle built the property next door. This is all my parents' property up here. There's my truck. And this is our easement road. And the people that bought the next door property put their travel trailer on our easement road. And, um, it's a bit of a fight <laughs> and a uh, little bit of a fight going on and that's okay except that they're bullying my 83 year old parents and that's no good here comes my mom on her Husqvarna tractor give us a wave she's not waving <laughs> she's 82 she just had a birthday all right you guys we're gonna keep going Okay, you guys, I found the next target and it's ringing up as a 3245. Says it's right at the surface. So let's get out our trusty F pulse that I'm in love with. It has all the markings, tell you how deep to go. Okay, where was I? Right there. All right. Oh, God. <laughs> okay, I see something right here. Right here. Pretty sure that's it. Whoops. That is it. Hey! Alright. If this was something of ours, it could have been a dog, part of a dog chain. My mom just got this mowed. So, this is where I'm going to hunt. There's a chicken coop, an old chicken coop up there. They did logging here at one point, and um, the base camp for the loggers was up here somewhere, so I'll check that out too and see what we can find. Oh, and there's two active cougars right here too, so I'm kind of trying to be careful. I don't have any weapons with me today, <laughs> so hopefully I don't run into anybody. Okay, you guys, I swept over this one more time. Let me see, did I, I turn this off? Okay, swept over it one more time and I'm still showing that 56. Okay, let's do one more. Just goes to show you always have to sweep your holes before you fill them up. Okay. Oops, come on. Okay, you guys, it looks like a nickel. Let's uh, see if I can... Let me get my glasses off. Get it. Oh, okay. It's clad. Let's see if I can get a date off of it. 
it looks like it says 1956 so we bought this property in 1983 so 56 predates I'm encouraged after finding that nickel that we might find some other stuff so let's just see if we can find something exciting besides just a Ooh, that sounds like either a big rock or something. Oh, nope, there it is. Another bullet casing. <laughs> I must have smashed it right there. There you go. All right, you guys, we found something else. It looks like, I don't know what. Okay. Something iron. <sighs> In something bigger than the hole I dug, I guess. Oh, now it's falling apart. Oh, it's something spiky. Oh, it's a, I think it's a railroad tie. Now that is not normal. <laughs> That's crazy. Okay, let's turn this off because we know where it is. I don't have gloves on. That's no good. Huh. Okay. Oh my goodness. Look at that giant nail. That is nuts. Wow. Wow, wow, wow. Crazy. Okay, you guys. Here's our next target. It says it's right at the surface. Let's get our trusty uh... Ooh. How exciting. I love finding stuff. <laughs> I feel like I hit something right there. What the heck is this? It is heavy. Super heavy. Let's see. That's okay, it. you guys. I just got another target. It's in the plug. It says it was four inches down. Let's see. I'm kind of out of breath. <laughs> well, that's interesting. What the heck is this? I have no idea what this is. It looks like this part of it is chrome. And maybe the whole thing is chrome. Wow. Huh, I have no idea what that is. If it looks familiar to anybody. Let me know. Here comes my mom. Not bad for 82, huh? <laughs> Hey guys, it's evening time in Willamette Valley, Oregon. And I bet you've never seen a geodesic dome. This is where my parents live. They have 16 acres. Anyway, the sun is going down. The Pacific Ocean is just right over that ridge. And there's a hoot owl. When I was out here earlier, he was hooting. So I thought I would try to capture him. Okay, you guys, let's do a wrap up of what we found today with the Fisher F-19 in beautiful Oregon. We found this big square spike. I don't know what this thing is. It's got grooves, it's round, it's got holes on the end. Here's a cap of some kind, some just random metal. Bunch of nails, this dog leash thing. I, I don't know, you guys are gonna have to tell me. Were skeleton keys ever made out of chrome? because this looks like the tip end of a skeleton key. And, but I can't imagine why it would be made out of chrome or at least why the very tip would be chrome. And then um, more random metal, a couple of gun casings, this ratchet extender, and the find of the day, the 1956 nickel. How much fun was that? All right, you guys, that was a lot of fun. It was nice and hot. 
a nice sunny day in beautiful Willamette Valley, Oregon, visiting my parents. I got to show you guys the new F Pulsar. It's not new, it's new to me. I love it, it's fantastic. Really finds the targets well. My F19 never fails. I love that machine. It's nice and light, easy to swing, and it finds great targets. So you guys, I hope you enjoyed. I will see you on the next hunt.